Okay, so uh, first thing first, uh, we'll start with looking at the core basis of biology. We have to understand what biology is. After we understand the scope of biology, then uh, we we'll start looking at uh, living organisms and life processes. Yeah, and then after that, you pick it from there. Okay. Okay, uh, I'm very happy to see that uh, most of the members are, are online. I believe the time is not with us. We can start with uh, the learning. Okay, so um, allow me to to just explain briefly what will be needed as we move together in this course. So, uh, all of you know that you need a book, a pen with you so that whatever we discuss uh, during your own free time you'll be writing the the points you'll be recording them in your book is very important so that eh, you'll be going through whatever we learn thank you that is very very important so i'll be dropping some hints on what we are about to discuss and then later on we pause for questions among other things thank you okay so generally speaking Biology is the study of uh, life, meaning everything that falls under the scope of biology, uh, it falls at looking how life is studied, how living things behave, and how they interact within the environment. That is the general way I can explain it. Okay, so now, having understood that, um, we are going to, to look at... Uh, the characteristics of living things or the characteristics of living organisms now before we go to that we have to understand that process of life that occur in all organisms are referred to as the characteristics of living organisms in case you are wondering when sir say characteristics of living organisms what is he trying to talk about i'm simply looking at it Process of processes of life that occur in all organisms. These are things that we call characteristics of living organisms. Having said that, an organism, we can just say that it's an individual form of life consisting of a single cell or a complex of cells in which organelles or organs work together to carry out life processes. So that is what an organism is. Okay, so uh, it's very, very important that you understand the characteristics of living organisms because without understanding these characteristics, you find that as we move further toward this course, you'll be having challenges to relate with some of the, the works that we'll be discussing because these characteristics of living things, they are interconnected with every topic that you are going to cover in biology so it's very important that you understand the brief introduction of characteristics of living organisms okay uh, so we are saying uh, the characteristics of living things may be summarized by the mnemonic mr griffith so what it means is each and every living organism on earth has these characteristics now, these characteristics, we are saying, they are being summarized by the mnemonic key, which is Mr. Griffith. So, this Mr. Griffith is just a memory aid that will help you to remember the characteristics of living things in a faster way. So, Mr. Griffith, that is the, the characteristics of living organisms. So, Mr., which is MR there, they stand for something. Griffith, we have G R E F I C. They also stand for something. So let's get on to it. Mr. M stand for movement. R stands for reproduction. G stands for growth. Another R there stands for respiration, excretion, feeding, irritability, also cells so this means each and every living thing has got these characteristics 
they are able to move, they are able to reproduce, they are able to grow, they are able to respire, they are able to excrete, they are able to feed, they are able to sense or respond to stimulus, which is irritability there. Then they have got cells. So this is very, very important for you to understand. These are the characteristics of living organisms. I guess you can hear it, you can see it. We are a team of professional teachers. That was a presentation by Mr. Mulinga. Please join our online classes so that we add you in our WhatsApp group. You start learning with us. Check out the timetable for biology. It's over here. For more information, please call us or WhatsApp on 0969 1757 01.